Hey everyone, Andy Sean 45 here. This recap is going to be very basic and to the point. Um, definitely not the kind of result I saw in this game. And oh boy, <laughs> I swear to God, this uh, this Notre Dame football team is taking years off my life. Um, definitely did not see that coming with Navy. I mean, I knew we were going to have some issues going up against the option, especially for the second week in a row. But man. <laughs> Basically, all I can say about this game today is this. Offensively, with the exception of a couple mistakes, we played great. I mean, Tommy did a great job. TJ Jones had a day. The running game came alive, which was really great to see. So, no complaints there aside from those from those couple of interceptions that Tommy threw and the one dumb penalty on the, the touchdown by Koyak. Um, but still, though, those two mistakes in this game could have came back to hurt us in the worst way possible. But thankfully, they didn't. Um, but uh, defensively, there's no way to, to sugarcoat it. Navy, Navy's offense embarrassed the hell out of our defense today. I mean, we had no, no answer whatsoever for their version of the option. Um, you know, I don't know what it is. I mean, obviously, we all knew that Navy was a better football team than Air Force was, but I just don't get it. I mean, you know, even though they're different teams, it was still the same kind of offense. I mean, I really I really honestly thought we were going to blow Navy out of the water. I mean, after that first offensive drive of the game that we had when Atkinson had the 41-yard touchdown run, I thought, boom, that's it. We're going to have a field day, which we did on offense, that is. But that wasn't the case. I mean, Navy, I got to give them credit. You know, they came to play and they they embarrassed our defense. And honestly, if it wasn't for, uh, you know, one Navy mistake on their, their last drive of the game when they were trying to get that go-ahead touchdown, we'd probably be sitting with a loss right now. And, you know, also, you gotta, I, gotta, I, gotta, I do have to give credit to Jalen Smith for, for making the, the big play on the fourth and four at the end. Um but really, overall, it was not a great performance by the Notre Dame defense. They just, um, I don't know what it was. I don't know if it was uh, just the hassle playing uh, their second consecutive option offense or if we weren't prepared. I, I don't know what the answer was. I guess, you know, just Navy, I guess Navy caught us at the right time. You know, cause, but I, I just don't see how you can go from, you know, putting... 50 points up on these guys for the last two years, and then all of a sudden you have a, a close showdown like we did today. I don't get it. But, you know, I, I, can't beat, I can't beat these guys up too much, really, because we did get the victory today. And I'm not trying to sound like a downer, but, you know, as a fan, you like to see your team perform a lot better than what we Irish fans saw out there today. I mean, so I really don't need to explain much. It's really... This is really a, a cut and dry case, pretty much. I mean, what more can you say about it? But I mean, you know, you can't complain. I'll, as an Irish fan, I'll take the win. I'm happy that we got the win. But most importantly, I am so freaking happy that we have no more option teams on our schedule. I mean, I, I hate. I, I told you guys before in the last video, I hate it when we play option teams because that offense is such a pain in the ass to go up against. It's frustrating. Um, but, you know, that's really all I can say, guys. I mean, I just hope, uh, you know, with the, these last three opponents that we have coming up in Pittsburgh and Brigham Young and Stanford that we can play much better on defense. But, um, yeah, I can't really call today a step back for the defense because, you know, the, as I've said numerous times already, the option is a much different offense than what we're used to seeing on a regular basis. Um... But um, I do, th I still do think we could have done a better job going up against it today. But you know, in the grand scheme of things, we get we got the victory. We're now seven and two. Um, you know, we're still in a great spot to run the table here, and um, definitely enough with with today's win, we have a chance to move up a couple spots in the BCS rankings, hopefully. And um, so yeah, we just gotta really work on finishing the season strong if we want to make a run at the BCS. Um, so yeah, with that guys, this is Indy Sean 45. Um, I will catch you guys later next week for my preview for the Pittsburgh Panthers. And until then, you guys keep it real. And even though I wasn't completely satisfied with our defensive performance, again, we got the victory. So go Irish, baby. Keep it rolling.